Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Vivian and I've been making squishy videos for as long as I can remember. I wanted to come on here and show you guys my entire squishy collection because it has been so highly recommended. I started filming my collection back in December of 2018 and unfortunately I accidentally deleted some footage. So, with that being said, I tried to make it up by showing you guys the new squishies that I have. And I also included a video footage of my actual squishy collection bin so that you can see how I organized it and all the new squishies that I have. So hopefully it's not super confusing. If you're wondering why there are suddenly so many squishies in the background, that's because the footage got deleted, so. If you are new here, I would love it if you subscribed. And also make sure you like this video and comment below what is your favorite squishy from my collection. And that way I will choose five random people to give a shout out on my next future video. So without further ado, let's jump into it. All right, to start off with the squishy collection, I'm showing you guys my full set of the mini Umino Sheeps. They're super cute, super slurizing, and I also love the packaging. Next up I have is this Hello Kitty squishy, and when I first got it, I was really concerned that it was gonna be really dense, but it's actually pretty soft and slurizing. Moving on to my Sumiko Garashi series, I have the crepe and I also have the fruit series with Neko in a pear costume. And Shirakuma in a strawberry costume. These mini Punimaru timekeeper owls and they're super adorable with a rubber tag. I have the one in the pink and rainbow design. This mini yummy pyre, and of course it had a very, very strong citrus scent, but it's super cute and very slurizing. This poly sugar bun, this is the Christmas series. This Winnie the Pooh Disney breadhead, and I love how slurizing this is. This is probably my most favorite design out of the others. Next are these animal popsicles, and this is the chocolate one from Punimaru, and this one looks exactly like Hajin Dawes, and I love Hajin Dawes ice cream and popsicles in general, so this is just perfect. Next up I have the Pepper Cha Cha Bon Bon series 2. Um, this is the galaxy blueberry design, and they're super soft and slurizing. I really love the paint job and everything. And I also have the limited edition Halloween series. Also from series 2 is this pastel rainbow design and Bonbon bon is holding a peach. From Quinny Squishy I have the series 1 catty corn and this is incredibly slow rising. You have to feel it for yourself. And the second design released is this catty corn mermaid. I got Snowy from back in 2016, and it's very slurizing and scented like grape. Moving on to my Yummy Bear collection, I have this rainbow design, and I really love this one because the ombre on the ice cream is so nicely blended out. Next up, I have the original Yummy Bear with the closed eyes. This polar bear yummy bear. A special Christmas edition reindeer yummy bear. This pink candy bear. The limited edition black sakura that came out just in time for the cherry blossom festival. To go along with the mini one, we have the jumbo yummy pyre. And lastly, of course, my favorite design of all time, the unicorn onesie. Moving on, I have my Molong and Friends squishies. 
and these are the softest things you can ever touch. I love these so much and they're very slurizing. I know they're very hard to get as well. I also have Pew Pew, which is a ye little uh, yellow chick. Super adorable, matches my nails. And lastly, I have this gray bunny. I'm not sure if it's also called Molong, but we're just gonna say it's Molong's friend. I have the Sammy chocolate donut. This jumbo white and pink ombre soft serve ice cream, and it's actually pretty dense. It looks very slurizing, but it's, it's kind of hard. Next up, I'll be showing you guys my set of Hello Kitty donuts, and these ones are in collaboration with Delightful Boutique. Inspiration is from their mascot, Snowy. This cake design, and I also have a set of the Christmas series as well. This mini eye bloom pineapple in the colors purple and pink. These are super soft and slurizing. I love how tiny they are. And I also have the orange design as well. Moving on to my full set of the Kirby Cream Puffs. This is the first production, so as you can see, it has a very fast pop-up. But nonetheless, I still love how cute these are and the designs are very unique. Next up, I have this marshmallow ice pop. This pink Care Bear Chiguri bread. The Jumbo Mother Garden strawberries, and I have this in pink and red. These next two squishies are personal decos that I received from an Instagram designer. Her name is Estrella if you haven't heard of her, but I got this for an anniversary gift and I really love it. They're not really meant for squishing, so um, yeah. <laughs> I have these Moodle Squishy Blue Llamas, and one of them is the original production, and the other one is a prototype. This My Melody Squishy. These Cold Stone Ice Cream Squishies, and I was very surprised that they made their own squishies, and I love Cold Stone Ice Cream. They're so good. So moving on to my Silly Squishies, Squishies, <coughs> rest in peace Silly Squishies, but um, if you didn't know, they closed down their company and their shop in general. So I do have these, um, the Pink Lemonade, the Narwhal Cakes, and a bunch of other fairy tale cakes. To add on with the Punimaro Animal Popsicles, I have this white bear and it has a chocolate bow tie on it. The full set of the mini Umakawa Unicorn Squishies. They're quite dense, but they're very slurizing. I personally love them for the design and their paint job. This Tokage Sumiku Garashi Macaron Squishy. 
Ooh, these are my favorite also. So these are the mini versions of the Bear in a Macaron Squishy. They're very cute and super slurizing as you can see. Here are my Jumbo Disney Tsum Tsum Ice Cream. This mini ice cream cone, and I'm not really sure what the brand is, but it's really soft and slow icing. Next up, I have the set of bread rolls, and these are licensed by Picnic. This Donald Duck Cruller Donut, and it's super cute. I love the design of it. This rare Kitty Creative Steam Bun. This marshmallow s'more, and I really love the design of this. It's really nice and super slurizing as well. This mini Yummy Bear Mermaid and the original design. Mini version of the Polly Mascot Squishy. This mini rainbow candy corn. As you can see, I collect a lot of mini squishies. And we also have the Kirby Squishies from the Squish Me series. The Mini Poly Heart Macarons in purple and blue. These are really soft and slurizing as well. Pepper Cha Cha also came out with these Bon Bon Macarons, um, pink design and a brown design. This mini Yumino cow in the black and white design. These super cute Mother Garden duck squishies, and they actually come in their own eggs. This three piece melon pan set from Picnic. Moving on, I have my jumbo ice creams from Bunny's Cafe. I have both of the Kumaton designs in yellow and pink. And lastly, I have this one in a candy corn design, super soft and slurizing. With some of my eye bloom squishies, I have the Jumbo Nyan Cat Pancake, and these are super soft and nice. They also came out with the mini ones recently, but unfortunately, I didn't have those at the time this video was filmed. This is the Jumbo Satcher Tort, and they actually recently came out with mini ones as well with multiple designs. And if you don't have this in your collection already, you need to have this because it's so soft and squishy and it smells amazing. Another Jumbo Eye Bloom Squishy recommendation is the Princess Cake, and I have this one in the pink strawberry design. There's also different designs like the rainbow one as well, which is really pretty. I also have this Jumbo Poly Head Macaron. This Harajuku Bear in the purple design. I also have this Cat in a Cupcake licensed by Nick. This fat cat squishy, and I actually don't know what it's called, but it's really slurizing. So I have this mini marshmallow pancake. These are really cute. I love the size of these. Very soft and slurizing. They smell like strawberries. And here is the boy. Next, I got these two, uh, Yeast Ken Toast Squishies. These were also pretty new. So here is this one. I don't really know the exact names of them, but it's pretty sticky on the top. And here we have Yeast Ken. This one is my favorite design. 
It even has like little baby chicks or ducks actually on the top. Super cute. Love it. So I have the full set of the Kirby Puffy Donuts. Diddly D, I believe. Or Wadly D. I don't really remember the name of it. We have this Kirby uh, textured donut. It kind of looks like a macaron to be honest. But this is probably my favorite design. And next we have the regular puffy donut. This one's really nice too. So I also got these new poly bun squishies. This is series two. Um, what's different about the first series is the obviously the color of the buns. Um, and it's also pearlized, so you can see a little bit of a shimmer on the bun. Here is the second design. This one comes in a baby blue. And I actually really love these colors compared to the first series. And lastly, here is the pink one. With this tag too. So we got some new Pepper Cha Cha Bon Bon buns. And this one is the summer series. Watermelon. This is pineapple. This is probably everyone's most favorite design. The Lunar New Year bun. You're the pig. Popular Boxes also came out with these new shell breads. They come in three different colors. Here is the tag. I really love the tag, it's super cute. Very slow rising. This one smells like uh, blueberry, blue raspberry. Here's the pink one. It smells like strawberry. And this is the brown one. It smells like a regular bread scent. So here is one of my drawers of my collection. Um, I didn't want to take everything out because I love the way I organized it and it takes a lot of time to really uh, put everything together. So I'm just going to be showing the new squishies in this clip. Basically I got this Bunny's Cafe Harajuku Bunny and I actually really love this one compared to the first mascot that she produced. Then we have this Aloha theme, Hawaiian theme uh, honey bottle. And I really love the rainbow design. It has a really smooth ombre. Then this is also in the Hawaiian series. Kumatan in a pineapple. I do have some tea about this though. I don't think this is an original design. But I think this is really cute. I also got some dongos. Unfortunately, I sold the other ones that I had. Uh, if you watched my previous YouTube videos, I unboxed this and I only kept the Hello Kitty design. So this is kind of an idea of what the other ones would feel like. Not too sure if I showed my full set of the ice cream, but here is Donald Duck. Really so rising. This is Mickey. This one's probably the most slurizing. And here is Minnie. Actually, no, I lied. This one is the most slurizing. Uh, Popular Boxes also came out with these Poly Head Macarons. The packaging is really cute, although I wish it was resealable. They're really slurizing as well. Comes in four different colors, and I believe they're all scented differently. The pink one is probably my most favorite design. Creamy Candy also came out with some more marshmallows this year. And one of them were these fat, fat marshmallow squishies. Um, they do have the Yummy Bear version, but of course marshmallow is always a favorite. So I got a full set of these. And I also got this Fat Cat squishy. This has been on my wish list for a very long time, and I recently got it from an Instagram seller. All right, moving on to the next drawer. All right, so this drawer happens to be the one with the most newest squishies that I don't think I've shown in my previous clips. 
So iBloom also came out with a bunch of new squishies uh, recently in the past few months. We got these new share buds. This is the Lolly Girl and the Angel Bunny. This is Millie and Billy the Whale. And these were the ones that actually came out first as the like squishies you can rip apart. So we have Angel Bunny and Fox. And of course, Millie and Billy. You might be wondering why I keep a lot of these squishies in packaging. It is because I personally love crinkly noises that the packaging makes. And I think it really keeps the squishy looking very new. So this is the Kumatan Melon Bun. And the kind of reminds me of a rainbow sherbet design. The donuts. I had the full set. But, of course, I sold them before I even got to filming this video. I got this rainbow heart macaron. Pusheen also came out with new squishies. I had this one and the cupcake design, but I sold the cupcake design and I kept the mermaid one. This is series 2, by the way. I have these cute cues that I got from a grab bag. And it's basically holding an Asian dessert. This poly bun. Just because I really love how dense and slurizing these are. Two of the Sumiku Garashi macarons out of the four designs. Just because these two are my favorite characters. And of course we have Shirokuma holding a pink heart. The texture of the squishy is amazing. And this is the normal version. I love how slurizing these are. I also got these poly sugar buns. Not sure if I showed them, uh, but these are amazing. This one smells like blueberry. Here is the coconut scent one. This, I believe, is chocolate scented. And this one is my all-time favorite melon scented plus the design is really cute I remember showing my yummy bears and snowy so we're gonna move on to these bread dolls that I got recently this is berry and this one is brownie Ooh, yes. Okay, my favorite part of the drawer. So iBloom and Sanrio did a collab together and they formed this. So this is the iBloom in collaboration with Sanrio Toast, a cinnamon roll, and cloud bear. Not much for squishing since toast squishies usually aren't very satisfying to squish for me um, or to me. But I love the, the designs. That's why I have them. We have My Melody and Angel Bunny. I really love these packagings because uh, it's very like a pink transparent uh, packaging. Here's Pachaco and Cotton Candy Bear. I feel like the personalities of the iBloom characters and the Sanrio characters really felt well together. We have Pom Pom Pirin and Marshmallow Bear. They're both really chubby and fat. <laughs> So that's why I think it's a perfect match. We have Foxy Fox and Little Twin Stars. And lastly, we have the Penguin and Karomi. We've got that little uh, devilish vibe right here. Oh, not to mention, iBloom made probably the best squishy ever um, in terms of texture. So this is the brand new Moose Bread. Uh, basically, it has like a little plastic wrap over it to prevent it from sticking. But look at that ASMR. Ooh, that glow. But these are different from any typical squishy that you would find. Um, it has a very shiny, glossy texture to it as if it was like real frosting or cream, however you want to call it. Uh, but it feels really nice, super soft. This one smells like strawberry, which is probably my favorite scented uh, squishy. Oh yes, the Koala March. They came out with the medium size of these. Uh, these are my favorite childhood snack, especially with chocolate filling. And of course, the Sumiku Garashi Toast. 
very thick. This is probably the nicest toast squishy that I have in terms of squishiness. All right, the last drawer. Voila! All right, so these are actually all my boxed squishies. Yeah, they're pretty much in boxes. I guess that kind of makes sense. So we have the iBloom Stories. I also filmed a video on this. Check that out if you haven't seen it already. And basically in this box is a giant iBloom cheesecake. Oh, yes. I'm not going to take this one out because it's too precious. But this one has the lollipop girl design. Oh, I also have this. So it's not really a boxed squishy, but it's kind of a miscellaneous one. Moving on to the miscellaneous side, I guess, uh, is this marshmallow bear and this Kirby. And also I have this homemade Sailor Moon cupcake squishy that I got from a fan many years ago. I showed the Mall Long squishies in the front, but I'm just gonna go ahead and jump into the Chigiri sets that I got. So first up is the Sumiku Garashi Chigiri set, and these actually came out, I think a few years ago, one or two years ago, I can't remember, and they actually just restocked on these, so I'm really glad that I got my hands on them. Uh, they look so precious, oh my goodness. I'm just gonna squish them individually. They all have the same tag, so I'm not gonna show you guys all of it. But I love how soft, yet dense and solarizing they are. Here we have Penguin. We have uh, Tonkatsu. Here we have Neko. Ooh, yes, so solarizing. Tokage. I don't know why he has a green tint around him, but... And lastly, we have the Shrimp Tempura. Super cute. The last Chigiri set is the Sanrio ones, and I love all the characters here. So here is Hello Kitty. This is the same tag. Ooh, very slow rising. So here we have Kiki and Lala from Little Tin Stars. Pom Pom Piren. A lot of people love this character. My Melody. And Gudetama, which is also one of my favorites. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the 30 minute video of my entire Squishy collection. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye!